Today's question is about paying attention to pain when you practice your yoga. Hi, I'm Dr. Melissa Weston. Welcome to Living Your Yoga. Today's question comes to us from Georgina from Facebook and she says, Hey Melissa, I've been practicing from your videos for around two months. Actually, I fell in love with yoga because of the way you teach it. So thank you, Georgina. That's really kind of you. Hopefully in the future, I would get through to the membership site. I have a question. I've been practicing now for the from the first videos, which I can t consider to be a little bit rougher than the new ones. And I would agree with that. I think my teaching has refined quite a bit since then. Um, anyways, I've got some back ache. It's not strong. It feels like when you sleep on in a bad position or when you do exercise and the muscles feel sore. I didn't give it so much importance since I think maybe it's just my back sore and tomorrow it will disappear, but I just wanted to ask if it's normal to feel like that or if I'm doing something wrong. And she says, I guess you are super busy all the time, but I hope that you answer me. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> kind regards and thank you for the things you do for people spreading yoga all around the world. And she sends me a big hug from Finland. So thank you, Georgina. So this is such a great question and I'm so glad she asked it. First of all, it's always important to remember that I am a PhD of cultural studies and communications and not a medical doctor. And so it's always advisable to work with a medical professional such as a medical doctor, an Ayurvedic doctor, a traditional Chinese medicine doctor, an osteopathic doctor, a registered massage therapist or a chiropractor if you're dealing with any kind of ongoing pain especially, or chronic pain. So let's, let's look at this question though as it relates to the scope of yoga. So with Georgina's question, back ache and aching muscles are okay, I think. And pain that you need to be concerned about is sharp shooting pain, electric pain, and pain that radiates. Muscles that feel sore are, well, sore muscles. <laughs> um, Richard Falds of Kripalu Yoga puts it this way, learning to distinguish between pain and discomfort is essential for safe practice. Pain's message is to be respected and movements that bring pain are not to be performed. The onset of pain is usually sudden and often described as shooting, sharp, or searing. After injuring, pain may take time to form a uh, may take the form of a throbbing or aching sensation. Now discomfort on the other hand is a dull or slower sensation. Discomfort is often the result of inertia or resistance to moving parts of your body that have become stiff or energetically sluggish. So I would love to hear from other yogis. How do you distinguish between pain and discomfort in your yoga practice. How do you d know when you're dealing with sore muscles or when you need to call up your registered massage therapist and make an appointment? So thank you so much for a great question, Georgina, and I look forward to hearing your comments below.